Oh my god. That works for us, I guess, even though we don't have to. And then super power! Um... Yes! 240. Zero to myself. Hey guys, welcome back to our first episode of... Why not episode? First PTT, PTCGO video of Ancient Origins set. Um, this is pretty much all Ancient Origins except for a couple of supporters and I think it's about it. Everything else is from this X, Y, and on. So if, if this deck, if whatever is rotating out won't be, won't be changed too much. And the only thing that I can see that will be rotated out after a while would be the ends and the chorus. Everything else is, is pretty much here to stay. So this deck is pretty current, I guess you could say. Uh, this one, this deck's gonna take advantage of our, our beautiful looking Golurk. He is a monster in his own. Look at his half art picture, it looks amazing. But Golurk is, the, is our main star of the show, and this deck was really thought about in the very beginning when we saw him at first time, and then his shine was kind of taken away by Vespi Queen because Vespi Queen is a little easier to come up with, it, ha it has a grass support and things like that. So, a Vespi Queen, I think, is more considered as more of the competitive version of this, this deck, but it goes by the same means and the same kind of thing. Golurk is a monster in his own right, and this is pretty much I'm showcasing him because he's I I pulled a lot of great cards from what I what I, what I had, but uh, I'm missing just a couple of things, so I don't want to showcase those decks yet. The one thing I did have was I had plenty of not Golurks, but I had plenty of the four Golurks and I had the four Evolutions, and that's why I kind of want to made it. So that's why I made this deck. We're gonna take advantage of this guy, Golurk. He's a 130 HP psychic Pokemon. So not the bulkiest, but pretty good for a stage one actually. Uh, he's got Data Stop, so it prevents all effects of opponents. Um, basically, opponents Pokemon, opponents Pokemon abilities do not affect Golurk. So if anything like Bats, Malamar, EX, anything like that that affects this kind of Pokemon, does not affect them anymore. That also goes for Wobbuffet, but Wobbuffet uh, doesn't exclude psychic type. Uh, uh, Wobbuffet's abilities exclude psychic types, so you're still fine. He also has his own ability, Double Type. As long as this Pokemon in play is psych, uh, as long as this Pokemon is in play, it is both Psychic and Fighting type. So you can not get him out with Kareen and stuff like that. But when he's on the field, he is both Fighting and Psychic. Uh, what's pretty good is because because of this and because of his resistance, this move right here, even though it says this amazing text in the bottom, you really don't want, you don't really you don't really care about it. Really, uh, Superpower is four Energy Cost Attack, but if you manage to get to there, it pretty much knocks out whatever's in your whatever's in your way. It does 80 damage base, and then you may do 40 more damage. If you do, this Pokemon does 20 to itself. Ignore that last part. Ignore this part. It's, ignore that if you do, this Pokemon does 20 to itself. That no, that doesn't matter because you resist it by 20 either way. So basically, it's asking you, do you want to do 40 more? <laughs> so basically, it's asking you, you want to do 80 or one uh, 120? Wait, wait. Yeah. It's basically asking you that. You want to do 80 or 120. Do not care about the if you do this Pokemon does 20 to itself. It doesn't do it. You resist, you resist it to begin with. Uh, his ability double type is amazing, but we're going to pair it with a couple of things here as known as the evolutions. Um, as far as your Golette line, I run three of the Fierce Fists just because they're able to attack with one energy with Dimension Valley. And this one yeah, kind of has a flip to it, so I mean, it's not that like, amazing, but I like the artwork of it, so add three one just because. Uh, of course, it's not going to be attacking with these guys. You want Golurk to be attacking, but I mean, there are times when I guess your hand kind of just mauls itself. But there you go. Uh, we have Eevee. Doesn't really matter which Eevee you do. I chose this one because this has more little HP, so just in case he's stuck up front, he can take a hit at least. He's with the fighting, so odds are if he's, take, if he's fighting a fighting deck, he's not going to take that one hit. But that's good enough. We also run one Jolteon with a new ability, or I guess it's a new ability, Electric Effect. Each of your Stage 1 Pokemon in play is now uh, Electric Typing. Uh, adding to their existing type. We're not, we don't care about the attack, but that's the effect we're going to use. Electric effect. The same thing goes for Reporion. He is Aqua effect, so basically every stage 1 has now water to the typing, and then we also take advantage of Flareon. Every stage 1 has fire typing. So along with Psychic, along with Fighting, we also get access to Electric, Water, and Fire. So Golurk is 5 types. Um, the only thing he's missing really 
I guess to be to be super strong in this set would be Leaf, a Leafeon with the same ability, but I understand why they didn't make that. I mean, having go up that many times would be super strong. But overall, he knocks out a lot of major threats. He knocks out Lugia, he locks out um, Manetrix, he locks out um, Tyranitars, he knocks out uh, Sceptiles, he knocks out all the main threats. Um, the only thing he doesn't knock out is Kyogre, Groudon, and Silent Hill, I would say. Because he doesn't get access to Leaf, but everything else besides that, his matchups are very good, I guess. Uh, we run two Acrobikes just to help draw powers. I was debating between this and Unknown, and the only reason why I chose Acrobike is because this is an item card, and I don't want to have too much clutter of Pokemon, so I don't want to like draw into my Unknowns um, by accident, or I don't want to have Unknowns as my starting Pokemon. So I, I chose Acrobike over the Unknown just to help make it more consistent. We got three level balls. The level balls are for the uh, EVs and Evolutions, but also for the Golettes. The only thing you can't get out of it is Golurk. So everything else is within range of level ball, which is what I love. I love level ball. It's the best card. Uh, Staggered Ash just to get rid of, uh, just to get back anything you might have discarded by accident, like EVs. We only run one of them, so uh, usually I want to wait to see what my deck, my partner's deck is, and then once he shows, a, I don't know, he has a. Fire typing. I usually just go for Vaporeon. You don't need a. You don't need fire. You don't need electric or fire Pokemon. You don't need fire for fire Pokemon. You just need the water. But just in case something does happen, you need to discard things. You have to actually get him back. We run three switches because Golurk is a pretty fat guy. He's a big husky dude. Um, we run four Ultra Balls. That's just for mostly getting out what you exactly need. Um, Golurk, I guess. I was thinking about Shaman, but eh, I think the deck runs pretty smooth by itself. Uh, three Burst Seekers. One chorus, one Lysander. Lysander is very important in the deck because you want to knock out things that are giving two prize cards and you have the ability to. Four ends, four sycamores, uh, four dimension values, and one of the most important things in the set uh, for this deck because four four energy is kind of a, a lot, but with the dimension value, you're able to put one psychic energy, one psychic energy, and one double colors, which makes it a lot smoother. Uh, oops. Three muscle bands just to boost the power. I mean, you don't really need to, but it helps out a lot of the times. Uh, two uh, head ringers, four double colors, and six psychic energies. The head ringers are optional. I put them in there just to slow down uh, EXs. Um, that's about it. The double colors are pretty standard, four, four. Like, you want to run the max, and then six psychic energy. Uh, the only thing that would happen that would maybe mess you up is with like a uh, sort of a stall deck. Anything that would ruin your energy disruption. Uh, would basically kind of slow you down. You can still you can still win the match, but it'll just slow you down. It's kind of annoying actually when they counting and knock out your energies um, because then you gotta reattach and because it has such a high energy cost. That's that's why it's more of a nuisance. But you can still win it through. As well as about it, that's the Golurk deck. Hope you guys enjoy it. Um, this is the first deck of the Ancient Origins uh, set. So we're going against a Wa the Trainer. But he's running fire, dragon, psychic, and colorless. That's a lot of typings there. We need a golet. And we got an N. It's not too too bad. If if we get first, I think we're I think we're pretty good because I don't know, that's pretty good. I wish I didn't get the Eevee. I mean I, I wish I didn't get the Joltown, but still it's pretty decent. What's the opening up with? Oh, ooh. Ooh, uh, uh, Adele Fox. I haven't seen this promo in a while. Okay. Ooh, and a Vatini EX. Ooh, this guy's got all the plays. Um. Okay. I really want to get the Eevee. I want to get the Eevee out. You're way too water, aren't you? Yeah. Well, of course, he's fire type. Duh. I want to get the Eevee out for sure, though. So I can get the Vaporeon. So I guess my best play is to N. Uh, that's not what I wanted from N, but <laughs> let me see something. Ooh, that's two games in a row that that um, uh, two games in a row that um, uh, that unknown's been prized. So just dirty. Oh, I guess I could have just done that. Huh? <laughs> oh well. Uh, oh well. Ooh, this guy's running all kinds of EXs here. Sharon. Okay. So 
So if we get a supporter, I think we'll be in the clear. We're confused, right? Yeah. Perfect. It's kind of what I wanted. <laughs> Perfect. Ooh, this is. Ooh, these plays are so hard. Golurk is such a scary mon. Level ball, give me that Vaporeon. Ooh. Ooh, kill him. Alright, so Vaporeon is there. We're just gonna put the Muscle Band just for show. And Super Power! And then, yeah, why not? 280, no damage to myself. Don't be afraid of Super Power. Super Power! And so now Golurk is in the clear. Uh, I don't think there's anything here that wants to take uh, super power like that. Especially not for Team EX. There's nothing here that wants to take that. Uh, but this is this is gold lurk. This is why it's scary. This is why it's scary. If you don't have evolution, the evolution deck, you can wreck, you can make the gold lurk deck. It's pretty fun. Uh, so he's got turbo energize. Okay. Steven, I have not seen a Steven in play. Steven's not a good supporter. If it lets you get special energies too, godlike, I swear, godlike. But it doesn't let you, so it's kind of eh. If it lets you get any type of energy, it'll be a way, a way better card because you can actually get your clutch special energy. But it doesn't, so it's not as great as it could have been. Uh, let's see. Silent. And dark, dark energy. Is this the uh, Mega Charles? No, but people, people protected you on it. Oh uh, well. He's gonna be. He's, let's see, 110. He's gonna be able to uh, combustion. Nah, uh, if he if he blacksmith, he can combustion blast, but he's gonna wing attack. We got another goal yet. Uh, actually, can we cancel that? I'm gonna put the second energy on first because if he might have a hand timer. That's all. Um, if it has a hand timer, it's really troublesome for me. But super power, yes, because there's no, there's no point not to. And there you go. I got a flare card, but nothing to get rid of that. So yeah, so it's all good looking good. You don't, you don't tell flare. I just that that first end was really scary because I got a lot of energies, but I got a sycamore. And that's that sycamore was what saved me because if not, then he would have set it up and it would have been in trouble. But that sycamore is what gave me the gold. So he's gonna, um, he is gonna combustion blast me. But that's fine. He thinks it's over, but it's not over. It's the exact reason why I put the second energy on it was just in case. So we gotta put our gold back down. You got rid of one. We got two now, and super power. Yes. Super battle, knocking out that Charizard EX. Bam, GG's no re. So, hello, Jason Crazy. Was he fighting Sucker? Close. Uh, good luck to you, sir. Hopefully, it's a good game. Uh, I'm go first. Oh, okay. Ugh. Not the most amazing hand. <laughs> Definitely the most amazing hand, but. Not, not, not a too bad of a hand, I guess. I gotta go first, so hopefully I draw something nice. Okay, I might, I might as well put you outside to res resist the fighting type. Our opponent has blinged out his deck with the fights. Okay, with Hippotamus, that's good. We're gonna put our energy there and then the problem is we to grass and mm -hmm. acro bike. Oh perfect and then uh should I go on then? No, nah, I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna end next turn. Uh, that way I can play down the Vaporeon and the Golurk. It's got Hippotamus, so obviously he's he's um he's running the Hippodon deck that I guess would Ugh oh, he's one of those decks too. Okay, he's only hit pot on deck, but I guess the one that. Ooh. All right, so yeah, odds are he won't miss twice. And basically, uh, it's the one that goes against EX. Is the resistant sandstorm? I think. I'm not exactly sure what it's called. Resistance sandstorm. Resistance. Um, I don't know. We'll see right now in a bit. 
Floatstone. Reverse Secret for the Karina. Alright, we're gonna go on level ball. And then get out another Golit. Our other evolutions are prized. That's good to know. We're gonna put our Vaporeon onto our Eevee. It doesn't really matter because none of them are weak to actually Vaporeon, but it's good to have him there. Just in case he has something else that comes out. Uh, I don't really want to evolve Golurk, but I'm going to evolve Golurk. And I'm going to end. I got two double colors, but I don't want to play that because he's got those kind of cards. Let me get the end again. I'm going to attach the double colors, hopefully he doesn't get rid of it, and then just gonna end my turn. If he does get rid of it, it's going to be a pretty long battle. I might deck out of energy. I might just run out of- oh. Okay, well, it's his third one he used. Okay, that's not bad, I guess. Fighting Stam, we don't have EXs. <laughs> so, fighting, fighting Stam doesn't do anything, really. I'm gonna put my energy right there, and I'm gonna devote to Golurk, and I'm gonna end my turn. I'm not gonna play it off like I have anything else. If he. If he uh, crushing hammers again, that's all he really has. This is, that's his fourth crushing hammer. There it is. Resistance Desert, that's what it is. Oh, and enhanced hammer, that's good. Are you still weak to grass? You're still weak to grass. That's fine. Uh, we're going muscle band. Our Golurk. Let's see. It's a good thing to sick more, so I'm gonna get rid of most of our cards. Get another goal workout. My unknown's also priced. Actually, I don't know why I got my goal workout. I don't know why I got my goal workout, but <laughs> we're gonna sick more dimension belly, and then we have three psychic energy, so I can get rid of the other thing. But it's gonna be prove really annoying. So I'm gonna superpower, and I'm gonna do 20 myself. Yes, 140, zero myself. Really, pull out a card. I got muscle band, I think. No, I don't know what I got exactly. So my opponent is gonna enhance hammer, obviously. It's gonna enhance hammer. So another point is, do I want to stick with? Oh, he's gonna birch. Man, this guy gets a lot of heads. Anyways, what is this? Reggie Rock. Okay. Let's see. He needs to have a double colors, right? And we'll do 60 again. I'm at 70, so I'll be fine. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna keep the I'm gonna keep the stay in there just so he doesn't do anything with it. Uh, everything else is pretty useless because he picked the one typing that I don't get advantage of. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, but I'm gonna muscle band this other work just cause and end my turn. There shouldn't be any way he knocks me out. Oh wait. I may have misplayed that. I think if he has double colors, 60, 80, 60. No, we're still alive. Good thing about resistance. Uh, let's see. Rock Throw does 40, we resist by 20, so that would kill me, but he needs to have a fighting energy on it. And that gets rid of this 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 Hippodon. Unfortunately, we're pretty low on energy, so it's gonna be like our make or break. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, alright. Uh, I forgot the stadium was removed, but we have that. Yes, I'll do it for you myself. Super Puff 140, knocking that out. We got a Flareon out, which is good to good to go. Uh, Bundle B is coming out. Bundle B can't really do much, but he's gonna use that turn to put. What? 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 Okay. I, I see what you're trying to do. It's a nice try. It is. But that's not gonna work. <laughs> Two A and a bundle B. I'm so sorry, Bundle B. Uh Reggie Rock's coming out, but Reggie Rock can't do squat. Because he didn't touch the energy on that. He's gonna shot him, which I think is just pretty much stalling the game now. I guess on the bundle we will do it. What's he gonna do? What's your play here, sir? You're trying to take me out, but I got 20 cards. 
and I have plenty of switches as well. He's gonna he's gonna go for the He's going for oh the end. Oh I see what you're doing, Big Sir. Okay. Uh He's gonna end me down to two. <laughs> but I'm trying to get rid of most of my cards here. Is there anything in here? Just gold works, right? I kinda don't want that either way. Uh that's fine. I'm gonna superpower again. Do another um, myself haha -ha. take my energy take my prize card he's gonna end me I'm gonna end down to two but other than that I think it's okay he already plays supporter so he can't play uh, last hunter so that's good yeah, I think he's getting out of the end again oh last hunter but you already paid you already paid your supporter sir so therefore I should win this pretty much excuse me that's that's pretty much game I'm gonna be just a little bit of a, of, a, of a messed up person. I'm just getting my dual talent real quick, so the whole squad comes out. And then I'm gonna super power and once again do 40 mess, uh, do 40 extra damage for nothing really. So bam, take that, take that hippo on. So his deck was pretty much a disruption deck. His deck was basically he was hoping to fight EXs, use hippo on stall, and then bundle beat a deck out pretty much. Reggie Walker was probably a new addition to his thing. Uh, that's pretty funny. That's pretty easy to get these things with then. Uh, okay. Well, that's good. All right. Well, that's about it. I hope you guys enjoy this matchup. I know it, I'm gonna have other videos with it because uh, I'm gonna have the other video before where I fought like a fire deck and the other one was a second deck, so I can show you guys how the weakness thing works. But hope you guys enjoyed this one. Didn't really go as well. I, there's not a Leafeon. There's not a Leafeon yeah, evolution, so I can't take advantage of grass typing. But oh well, if it was if this was the Vestry Queen deck, then that would have worked totally fine. But you know, it doesn't work out like as that life isn't fair, I guess. But either way, um, hope you guys enjoyed the battle. If you guys did like the battle, please like the video and then comment on the bottom. With so yeah, there it is. Um, that's Golurk. This is gonna be the new, the new, the, I guess the first deck of the new set. But yeah, all right. Uh, that's why now. All right. Bye guys, have a great day. Oh, I can look at my opponent's deck. Hmm.